What is going on, Lunatic Fringe? I hope you're having a great day. I know that there's some you know, uncertainty regarding Iran, Israel, things that are going on in the market, but I don't want to talk about that today. I want to talk about something very, very simple. You guys are nervous. A few of you are nervous. You've reached out to me personally and asked me, what do I do about my crypto wallet <coughs> once station goes dark? Now, nobody's taken over station, so we don't really have any information. Terraform Labs has gone no bueno on speaking, and so has uh, Fleece Cannon, uh, Chris Amani. Um, so we don't really have any clarification, but I want to point out something to you that's going to make this a little bit easier and acceptable. When the station is no longer supported, the station wallet, it will still work fundamentally. No, that doesn't mean that you can no longer have access, but here's the thing. In the event that you are concerned about that and you want to have access, let me tell you how your wallet works. Okay. When you are on the blockchain and when you make a purchase of crypto on that blockchain, your crypto does not transfer to your wallet. It is still on the blockchain. Your wallet is basically a window to the section of the blockchain that you own crypto on. Okay. The, right, the way that that is secured is by a seed phrase. That's how you access everything with your seed phrase. So what we're going to do in just a few moments is I'm gonna show you how to change wallets if you feel so inclined. So if you like this type of content, make sure you hit the like button on the way in. I'm gonna take you through this process. It's actually fairly simple. Um, I don't think it's gonna be that difficult. And there's really good news as a matter of fact. Now, first of all, I'm on cosmos.network. Now you remember that there is a proposal that just got approved. That proposal is to remove the fork modules from Terra Classic so that the Cosmos SDK basically will work out of the box, okay? So that would mean that any wallet that's Cosmos compliant, you can use. Now, how does that work? Remember, you have a seed phrase. In your uh, station wallet, you have a 24 phrase seed phrase. Then what you would do is you would just import it into another wallet because that wallet, again, is just your window to be able to see inside. For this purpose, I'm going to show you Kepler wallet. We're going to click on get Kepler and then we're going to get it and we're going to click Chrome because I'm using a Chrome browser and we're going to add it to Chrome. We're going to add this extension. Okay. Now I want to tell you something before we go any further. Full disclosure. I do not contain, I do not hold crypto on this computer any longer. As many of you know, I got hacked and I got hacked from a Windows PC. So if you download the Kepler wallet, I would recommend that you would do it over your Android or iPhone for greater security and protection. And don't, whatever you do, don't download a Zoom phone call from somebody because that doesn't work out very well. So anyway, uh, we're gonna import the existing wallet. That's the, the step here. We're gonna click on this and it's gonna be use recovery phrase or private key. We're gonna use that. We're gonna collect that right there. Uh, and we're gonna use the 24 word phrase and we're gonna start typing it in. Now I'm gonna skip forward here because I don't want you to see my seed phrase. Okay, so I've imported all 24 words in my seed phrase. Let's see what happens. We're gonna set up a wallet name. We're gonna set up our password, which again is obscured so you can't see it. And then we click on the import button and boom, immediately, as you can see, I have 9.3 million Terra Classic in this wallet. I have 221 Luna in this wallet. I'm done. So uh, we're gonna save that and we're gonna click on the Terra Classic network, which is gonna be, don't worry, you can change your selections anytime in the manage chain visibility. So for the moment, we're gonna select this one. We don't need the rest of these, but I want you to, I wanna point out here that if th this Kepler wallet is very robust. So going down the list here, you can use Terra Classic, you can use Terra, ago, the valuation of Cryptonomy.finance was $3.7 billion according to the British government. Today, that value, $6.1 billion. This company has managed to raise $2.4 billion in capital over the last 365 days. If you're looking for a place to get information about investment opportunities, then Cryptonomy Telegrams are the place over here. This is the quarter, uh, this is the quarter, third quarter uh, marketing overview. This is Ben Armstrong has predicted uh, XRP past ETH in market capitalization. These are news articles that are constantly giving you the information that you need 
Additionally, there's an update channel and it's giving you market structure playouts. It's giving you market updates on each major country and indices that there are out there right now to give you an idea of what is going on in the market so that you can get an idea of what it looks like broadly and how these governments are working. Big news, articles, whatever you need, Cryptonomy has it for you. Not only does Cryptonomy have it, but myself, Dean DCA, Crypto, Lyft Capital, Jake Gordon, we're all writing articles for Cryptonomy. You can come check. I did one on Immutable Quarter 2 of 2024. Uh, we've also got Thorchain, State of NYM, and we got Ronin's Web3 Gaming Empire. Guys, if you need information about this crazy crypto market, then by all means, you need to go to economy.finance slash research. But none of that matters unless you are using cryptonomy.finance the way that it's meant to be used by setting up fixed staking so that you can earn some significant yields. Let's set up a deposit today. Today we're dropping three ETH into a nine month contract. All right, we've created that, but the biggest move into all of it is the launch pool. Guys, I cannot stress enough. They've had 57 X average return so far in their investments. If you just create a deposit, I've got a potential for up to 5X with a 50-50 profit sharing from the launch pool. We're gonna create this contract now for $20,000. And there we have it. The anticipated profit between one and 5X when this thing is completed. And it will complete in October of 2025, just in time to cash out for the bull market. So what are you waiting for? Sign up for Protonomy.finance today. You can use any Cosmos hub, uh, the Atom wallet. You can use Ethereum. Uh, you can use Agoric, Akash, Arbitrum, uh, Avalanche, Axelar, Base, Blast, BNB. This is a robust platform. It uses everything. Let's just select all, and then we're just going to save it. Now, if you have it that way, you're going to come over here, and then you're going to click on your Kepler wallet right there and then you will see it pop up over here in your right-hand corner. So anytime you wanna access your wallet, you click on it right there and it will tell you how much you have in that wallet. This wallet is only for Luna Classic for me. So again, I wanna stress here, I have staked amounts and then I have amounts that I've pulled out that I'm holding on to for purposes. And you can see here from this chain, you can move over here and you can add tokens if you need to. You can add contacts, et cetera, et cetera. You have this as a side panel if you need to. And as well, um, you can click on this and you can change the wallet name. Uh, you can view your recovery phrase. You can do whatever it is that you need to do in order to make that happen. And then it is just this easy. You wanna make a trade or something like that, then all you do is attach your wallet to any one of these locations and it will work for you. And by the way, uh, full disclosure here, if you look up above, if you look up above, then you will see my wallet ends in CSC. This is the same wallet. So that's it guys, that's all you have to do. One of the other things, by the way, fascinating, I should point this out while we're doing this. Uh, I have 5.2 million staked over here at a 9.56 APY. It knows that, it's telling me that. And how much rewards I have right now um, that I can claim. And then when I've sent or received any other, whether it be rewards or whatever the case may be, this thing will track whatever it is that you need. Now let's clarify. My preferred wallet is going to be Kepler right here. But Leap Wallet works the same way. Cosmos Station works the same way. MetaMask will work the same way, and Citadel One, they all support Cosmos. Now, uh, my problem with MetaMask is that I really haven't heard anybody talk about using it for Luna Classic, so I'm gonna wait to try it until after we remove the forks, just in case. But if you import a 24 word seed phrase into MetaMask, I would have reason to think that right now that your MetaMask wallet would work just perfectly well. So. That's it, guys. I hope you found this helpful, and I hope that this takes you a long way on your crypto journey. If you like this type of content, I'll put out more of it, uh, but uh, make sure you hit the like button and leave a comment down below and share this with your friends, especially those people who need to know what to do with their wallet in Luna Classic. It's not financial advice, but I'm always right.